welcome, travelers, champions, heroes, and villains, to the adventure. I have some news to share with you all that the last hour, hour and a half of recording did not make it into my recording. So we are actually still in An Orlando. We didn't really make that much progress, but we did progress, as you can tell, because we're wearing new armor. When we were last being chased that you all saw there was imps and such and we essentially just ran our way fell off there and it took us into the interior of the castle so we are in fact wearing new armor which is havel's armor the helm armor gauntlets leggings and we do have a tiny being ring everything else other than that is the same we did achieve a few level ups from souls because there's a lot of souls to achieve in here and we met our buddy Solaire inside An Orlando, where we found our bonfire. The castle interior eventually starts opening up, which I believe we've opened up most of it. But we've been working on beating our way through these Silver Knights. To moderate success, as evidenced by my corpse over here. We did... Originally go into this room, which had a illusionary wall right here, which led downstairs to a bunch of mimics where we acquired all of Havel's armor, so it wasn't that far off. That door with the writing on the ground is locked originally, so I'll show you the path that we had to eventually take. We gotta go up the stairs in here. The second floor. As you'll notice, there's a set of stairs kind of going opposite to us, which you can't quite access. There's a few mimics up here as well. We got some coins out of it. We went this way where you can see some knights and treasure chests down there that we opened, as well as a bunch of like dragon heads or monsters. I'm not still not entirely sure which, as well as some knights that go above a headless statue. One of those crawler guys that were in the tower. And you constantly just hear the knights moving around. It's obnoxious. Obnoxious. But the way we would go was over here. Where I... Okay. Somebody's angry at us. There's in fact, a Silver Knight up here as well. Where we've just been mostly working again on parrying, because it seems to do the best. They do love to scream as they die, but we would eventually... No. <laughs> no, we did not. Did we? Yes. We eventually went that way. Yeah, that's correct. We went up these stairs, go to the top. There's a knight over here that gets spooked really easily, so he usually comes charging out at us. There we go. Get our little parry on him. The dude over to the right of us just kind of eyeballs us as we do that. And he... Leads further into... Yeah, we got some nasty fat rolling with this armor. I mean, we didn't really have great armor to start off with. Well, great rolls to start off with. But they're even worse. But the armor is outstanding, defense-wise. And as is evidenced, I take a lot of damage. So then, you would go further down here. And you would meet... Well, our Onion Knight friend was hanging out in here, where we'd have to open this door, and there would be a knight <laughs> right there. Come on. Apparently our friend has decided to leave for now, which is fine. He's the one that gave us the ring for killing all the knights in here that we are now using. It gives us a small boost to health. And there are a total of three knights in this room. Come on. 
Come on. Yep. Just whiff that parry, whiff that parry. There we go. Camera angle is always one of our more hated enemies. But we get... Yep. Get a little chug. Come on. There we go. Get our parry off. And this brings us back down to the first floor. Where we originally got the armor, essentially. Wait. Yes. No, this is the second floor. But that opens up the original first shortcut that you would go to. And then... We would go a little further up. I don't even know who's throwing spears at me anymore. Just everything hates me. It, it's how the game is. But this brings you to the opposite side of the stairwell, essentially. So that we can go back. And if is it this side. Yes. And then you'd go down here. This is the monster room that you could look down and see the Silver Knights. You'd go all the way down here. Okay. Oh crap. And we're dead. But that takes you to the first floor. You can open the door to the first floor so then you can go all the way... You can sneak your way up from the first floor that way. And at the bottom of those stairs is the path to lead onward. That is as far as we've gotten in three videos that you missed out on. But we did... Potentially, we found the white fog to a new boss. Eventually. So. Essentially what this does is that opens a shortcut to the next part of the level, which is nice. So instead of fighting all those silver knights that we fought before, we instead fight like three. So yes, that opened up this door down here. Be useful. And apparently I'm... Oh yes, apparently they can launch their spears through the walls. Because, of course, they can. Oh, jeez. There we go. Let's get our parry going on. So, that is what you guys missed out on, and I apologize for my poor video skills, but you are all caught up now as to what occurred in the time period that we were gone. Well, I guess you all didn't see it, but <laughs> I promise I did it. And we've retrieved our souls. We we'll just move onward. Yeah, across this way is like one of the headless little statue guys like that. And he's very angry. He takes like no damage. I decided I didn't care enough. And we would just continue onward. So onward we go. Oh, we did find one other thing, though. When we came in here, there was a message that popped up on the screen that said the black eye orb was, like, vibrating. So if we use the black eye orb in here, we get to go fight the guy in the gold armor that killed the firekeeper out in front of Firelink Shrine. The downside is there are... Um, Three people in there. So it's kinda hard to do. And let's just bail. I said let's bail. I said let's bail. Let's just bail. Okay. Okay, here we go. 
do the swing. There's a white fog gate up here. So let's go experience that and get away from everything. So yes, we have Dragon Slayer Ornstein and Executioner Smo that are just going to annihilate us apparently. That is as far as I had achieved on our own. There was a little cute video before, so I guess we don't get to see that again. But yeah, that is the depths of we've achieved. We did use humanity to kindle the bonfire, so there is in that room, there is a uh, sign on the ground to summon Solaire to join the fight, which we'll probably do again. However, I kind of want to try and invade the uh, fire keep. Man, just forget how to play the game and block and parry. That's cool. Okay, chug. There we go. Man, I'm getting a little too happy on the parries, but... We're getting there, I swear. We're making progress, even if you didn't see it. Come on. See, stabbing through the wall like that is janky and wrong. Yep. Yep. There we go. You can circle around and poke these guys in the butt, I found, but it's obnoxious and parrying, I feel, is something I really need to get better at. So that's what we've been working on. And smack. I did also decide that when we can, when we find a blacksmith again, we're probably going to change out the enchantment on this halberd because it just doesn't feel like it's doing damage anymore. I'm getting real tired of just like the weak uh, hits. Let's see what we can do. Black eye orb. Yes. We're gonna go. We're gonna invade the spirit. Well, invade the world of him. I believe we start at the bottom with three. There's, yeah. Invaded the world of Knight Lotric, the, the guilty. Can we just shoot like one of you? Will that work? No. Of course not. I really just want to aggro one of you. Oh, no. Yeah, that's... Why would that work? Ah, oh, they hit so hard! <laughs> oh, Lord. You die. Your phantom was vanquished. Returning to your world. Fantastic. Although, we do keep our souls, apparently, when we do that. And I think everything respawns, so if we keep doing that, we'll either win or be able to level up enough to eventually win. So that might be our goal as the Dragon Slayer and executioner hit really freaking hard. Oh, come on. That was a parry. That was not. So we can at least get the butt stabbed. Drink. Haha! -ha. <laughs> Our overzealous parry came back to help us in the end. <laughs> Let's see what we can do over here. Okay. Okay. Here we go. So, I mean, we get like 3,000 souls per run. Ooh, 
He dropped something. Silver Knight Shield. We did also find in the like those treasure chests down there it had the Silver Knight armor. So I'm assuming we could wear it and look like them as well. I think we may have found our little safety thing because we don't have to come back and get our body. We can just keep fighting this jerk. That could work. I feel like the Firekeeper deserves a little bit of just justice, right? Seems fair. I don't want to kill the stupid caster first. Right, jerk. Yeah, okay. Here we go. What you got? What you got? <laughs> no, no, no. Chug, chug, chug. Okay. Let's go up. Okay, let's not target the dude down there. Let's go run up top. Let's see if we can eat. Yeah, fall off. Come on. Woo! Parries in, but we're not getting like do the crit hit back. We got one. Let's run, 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 run. No, oh, no! Oh, that, that damn caster. I think if we could kill him, we could probably actually do this. Okay. I was kind of hopeful that. Uh, was it Lodric when he fell off it went hold in because that's kind of been our MO move sometimes with getting things to die by just uh, letting him fall off high locations but who knows eh getting that timing down a little bit better There we go. Hey! That was like three in a row. It's pretty outstanding. Didn't drop anything else? Nope. Okay. Alright. Alright, let's do this. Vengeance for the Firekeeper at some point. At some point. Correct items. What? room yet, I guess. There we go. Use item. I'm glad we don't have to be, like, human to do this, because we'd probably be losing our humanity a lot. <laughs> Alright, here we go. I almost, like, should we try and just bail around and just annihilate the caster? Does he not have much health? Does he please not have much health? Okay. Okay, here we go. Yes. Nope. I want to butt smack him. Okay, let's run away. Nope, nope, nope. Nope, 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 nope. 
Maybe we can do like a falling attack. Maybe that'll be the game plan. Chug? Oh jeez. Smack. Smack. Yes, yeah, so you just roll off the edge. You roll off the edge, dude. Oh, that's good. Maybe we can get you. Get you. Get you. Get you. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Chug, 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 chug. Okay. What you got for us, little knight dude? Ah, look at that fat roll out the way. Okay. Smack. Chug. Smack. Smack. Okay. I don't know what is up with his feet. Like, why they're glowing blue, but apparently they are. Dude. Get him. Is that it? Nope. That was it. Alright. Now it's just me and you, buddy. I'm only down to one Estus. Chug it. Smack. Smack. Oh, we got him. You are avenged, Firekeeper. Souvenir of reprisal. The guilty pay the price, returning with souvenir of reprisal. I don't know what a souvenir of reprisal is. But hopefully it's something... Hey! We get the Firekeeper's soul back. A ring of favor and protection and five humanities. Heck yeah. You know what else that means? We also have enough souls to level up again, probably. Change equipment. Can it give us a ring of boost HP, stamina load, breaks when removed? Good to know. That seems pretty good, though. Like, but I want to take it off. But... We can totally go back to the bonfire, hang out with Solaire, and level up a little bit. And that would be quite excellent. Here we go. As we run out of stamina, so... At the very least, we have avenged the Firekeeper. Which is fantastic. Level up. <laughs> oh, really? We have to go kill one more thing? I believe there is one of those knights over here. There is. What you got, buddy? Smack. I'll kick you off our sword or off our spear. See so you two use a spear. Man of class. That'll do it then. Fantastic. We will take take some more dexterity. Keep that stamina going. Although strength is good to keep us doing damage. Because we're so close to like killing those guys in one hit off of the um like parry attacks. So maybe it'll be strength. Same time it's probably health is really important. Everything's really important, man. Let's do health. We get hit a lot. <laughs> a lot, a lot. Uh, repair. <laughs> repair everything while we can. Because we had them break that one time. But I think that's all the time we have for for now. I again apologize for not showing how we got here in the first place, but hopefully you got a general idea of what we accomplished during that time. 
we will, I guess, be taking on Smo and Ornstein, was it? When I see you all again in the next adventure. Bye for now.